All right, 1006 now, hunting for good deals at a garage sale can be pretty fun, uh, but what's better than maybe one garage sale? Try more than 300. That's right, West Seattle is where we find Fox 13's Dan Griffin scoping out some garage sales. I mean, 300 of them in that neighborhood. Yeah. So, Dan, what have you found so far? What are you going to buy? <laughs> well, you know what? You know, people always think when they think of garage sales, I think you think of the stuff from like last year. Let me right. get rid of these clothes. Let right. me get rid of this little tykes toy, whatever it is, you know, right? Well, we're here at Brad Brzezinski's uh, setup in his backyard. He actually does glass blowing, and all of this stuff is original stuff that he has created. And it's just really cool because everything is unique. Brad, we're talking about kind of what goes into making these items and how you got started. Can you kind of walk us through that? You bet, you bet. Um, 22 years ago, my wife bought me lessons uh, at uh, Seattle Glass Blowing under the monorail. And uh, from the very first day, I was hooked. In fact, there's a couple pieces that we have in the back room that I didn't bring out for the sale because they were my first pieces that I made. But I've been hooked ever since. Now we have a studio, Rent, rent and Art and Glass Studio in near Ikea. And um, I go in every Saturday morning and make, you know, marbles or platters or hummingbird feeders lately have been really popular with summer coming up. Um, but, you know, it's just we keep 175 pounds of molten glass uh, at 2100 degrees Fahrenheit 24 hours a day. And we go in and gather glass and work with it. Well, you know, I think it says a lot. We were going to garage sales and a neighbor said, you've got to go check out Brad's setup. So we came over here to check this out. And I got to say, everything is so unique. What goes into designing this stuff? What inspires you? Well, I'm inspired by a lot of uh, nature, uh, marine life. Uh, I do jellyfish. I, the hummingbird feeders is a way to, to let people commune with nature. Um, and, and, and the colors. A lot of the platters that I do have kind of a, a marine theme, you know, turquoises, and they look kind of like waves. And so mostly it's just the world around me that inspires me. Well, I know this is going on through the afternoon. If people want to stop by and check this out, where can they find you? So um, on West Seattle Garage Sale Day, we're uh, driveway number 69, but we're at 3241 47th Avenue Southwest in West Seattle, right near Madison Middle School. Okay, fantastic. Well, I do love this stuff, and I love checking this out. I'm going to spin around here. I've got a cord. Um, I am really enjoying checking this out because you see so much uh, art, culture, talent, and stuff uh, when you look at all of this. So, obviously, Brian, this is what we're finding, and it's just really, really cool and unique and really speaks to uh, West Seattle. So uh, that's yeah. where we are this morning, and we're going to keep checking some stuff out. I just think it's really phenomenal to see so much talent here this morning. Absolutely. More than 300 I mean, garage sales, but also like, you know, small markets as well. So what a, what a cool event. Yeah. That's great. Awesome. Yeah, Dan. very much so. All right, Dan, have a good time out there. Thanks a lot.